G Money Rides, G Money Rides, yeah. Can't slow down, might get a speed ticket. G Money Rides, known for popping willies. Cops pull me over, then they let me go. Catch me if you can, or eat my dust, bro. G Money Rides. What's up, fam? Uh, gonna talk a little bit about a, a subject that's near and dear to my heart, and that is gear. Uh, if any of you know me, or have actually talked to me, you know that I am about all the gear all the time. At that. Um. So let's kind of, you know, let's kind of go through uh, uh, what I wear. Uh, I've got a bunch of different gear. Uh, I wear for different, uh, different temperatures is the main thing. And of course, protection is another thing. Um, so what I'm wearing right now would be like my summer outfit. Okay, so I've got a pair of bullet riding jeans. Uh, they've got like the Kevlar in them. And then I've got underneath the underneath the jeans, I've got a, uh, a pair of Thor uh, knee and shin protectors. And then uh, I've got this fly racing jacket that's uh, armored, uh, elbows, uh, shoulders, back, chest a little bit. Um, uh, I've got the claw gloves and the TCX riding boots actual riding boots oh boy hope they're okay light jacket it's got a bunch of mesh in it in the chest as well uh, and then I've got uh, you know it'd be the same setup from the from the waist down but then I've got my Joe rocket leather jacket uh, that would be more I don't know spring fall you know under 60 degrees uh, something to wear like that and, and it's uh, it's fully armored as well as uh, and it's got the uh, you know the back bump on it to help a little with aerodynamics. Haha. -ha. of course and uh, you know I can tell you from first hand experience that that is a armored jacket and it worked very very well in a 70 mile an hour plus crash for me uh, and, you know and I'll, and I'll give you pictures of all the all the all this gear this right here I, I 
actually crashed in those so I mean and my hands didn't get tore up uh, but they don't offer the lever, le level of protection that say uh, a leather glove does or a gauntlet glove a, you know true leather gauntlet glove and then of course I've got uh, you know, I've got my one-piece suit, and that's, uh, you know, that's for track day and for when I want to uh, fuck around in town. And then, of course, I've got my one-piece suit, you know, that's for track days and uh, when, when I feel like uh, uh, being completely protected uh, when I'm riding around town. I love my suit so that's pretty oh and uh, uh, so with the suit come uh, uh, Cortex uh, white and black riding boots that are calf high uh, as well. match the suit so and then you know my girls blue the suits blue white and black it, it, it just looks awesome I think So that's uh, that's a rundown. Then of course we have helmets, and I I just uh, just bought a new bell that I haven't quite figured out whether I'm just going to keep it for track days or whether I'm going to set it up for uh, moto vlogging. And then, of course, I got my Scorpion that I wear all the time that's all set up for moto vlogging. Got my own hand, uh, handmade chin mount and all that, yeah. much completely different. So there you guys go. That's uh that's pretty much a review of my gear, what I wear, why I wear it, um, and what conditions I wear what. So Thanks for watching. Oh, I guess it'd be this way. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.